creating edemas, the larger the edema, the lower the pressure should be. Whereas if pressotherapy is being used as a preventive measure or to maintain correct circulation, higher pressures can be applied. As the abdominal corset will not be used in this case, the preset value of segment 7 should be set to zero. Press the stop start key. The start indicator light will go on. The motor will start to operate and inflation of the boots will begin. Compression begins in segment 1. It remains inflated while segment 2 is being inflated. Then 3 begins to inflate while segment 1 begins to deflate. Then 4 begins to inflate and 2 to deflate. And this is repeated in centripetal direction until the cycle is completed. In this way, compression is always present in the central segment. And while the next begins to inflate, the pressure ceases in the furthest away. This operating mode produces a pressure wave in centripetal direction which in turn produces an effective reactivation of venous and lymphatic circulation in a physiological manner. The circulation of liquids towards the heart is favored while the inflated segment prevents backflow. The sequence generated by Pressor O3 Excellence produces a rapid reactivation of venous and lymphatic circulation, efficiently stirs the stasis and favors the re-education of the valvular system. The physiological pressotherapy treatment is an ideal complementary method to most treatments, either as a system for preventing circulatory disorders or for keeping it in good condition. During treatment application, blood pressure can increase by 20 mercury millimeters, for which reason it is necessary to be cautious with patients with slight high blood pressure and is totally counterindicated for patients with severe high blood pressure. The normal duration of a pressotherapy session for aesthetic, preventive or maintenance purposes is from 20 to 40 minutes and frequency is from two to three times a week as long as the process to be treated does not recommend any other methodology since in specific disorders a daily treatment could be necessary. Once the programmed treatment time has expired, the unit gives off 10 audio signals and deflates all outlets, showing the parameter screen and remaining in standby for new instructions. Intense pressotherapy treatment, personalized in accordance with blood pressure. In this case, as we are interested in draining closer areas, the abdominal corset will be used. This latter segment should be connected to tube number seven. One of the most important characteristics of Pressor O3 Excellence is its capacity to adapt the applied pressure to the blood pressure of the person being treated. To measure the blood pressure, place the tubular accessory on the left arm above the flexing point of the elbow. Press the start key. The screen will show the message, blood pressure is being measured. Please wait a few seconds. At this point, Presser O3 Excellence pumps air into the accessory until reaching a pressure that is sufficiently high to block blood circulation of the extremity. Therefore, it is normal for the patient being treated to feel a certain oppression on his or her arm. During this process, the patient's arm should remain relaxed without any abrupt movements or muscular contraction, nor strike the accessory as it is extremely sensitive and could cause an error in the pressure reading. When this accessory is completely inflated, the air release valve opens automatically and the pressure begins to drop slowly, 
while the unit reads the corresponding values. If once deflation is finished, no error has been detected in the pressure reading, the results will appear on screen, which for this patient are systolic pressure 113, diastolic pressure 46, heartbeats 52. Press the pressure button. In some cases, an indication of an error can appear on screen. It would then be necessary to check correct connection of the tubing, or the position of the arm accessory, or the arm itself. If the pressure is to be measured again, just press the start key. But if this is not considered necessary, press pressure. You leave the measuring process and go back to the treatment screen. Presser O3 Excellence will limit the applicable pressure to a maximum in accordance with the systolic pressure of the person to be treated. Select treatment program 3 of mode 1 or intense. But moreover, Presser O3 Excellence will adapt the treatment parameters and pressures in accordance with the systolic and diastolic pressure values obtained. Pressing start begins the treatment. First of all, a pre-inflation cycle is carried out. Compression is begun in the most distal area, that is to say at the foot, and rises sequentially towards the proximal segments while maintaining compression in the already inflated segments. In this way, when the cycle ends, the entire treated area will be under compression. Between one cycle and another, total decompression of the treated extremity should be carried out. This treatment produces a strong draining effect, and thus should be used with extreme precaution beginning with low pressures that can be increased slowly and progressively. The pause between pressure cycles should be long, longer than the inflation time of each segment. It should never be used with high pressures. Mode 1 or intense, adequate for the treatment of elephantiasis, large edemas and cellulitis. Other treatment methods with Pressor O3 excellence. Mode 2 or groinal. Similar to Mode 1, but with a previous additional step that unblocks the lymphatic nodes by compression on the lymphatic ganglionic groups. The first segment to inflate is the one located at the base of the arm or leg, with which the armpit and groin ganglionic group is compressed. And then the sequence is begun from the most distal extreme, rising sequentially and steadily to the closest extreme. This program is normally used on patients with lymphatic component edemas, operating at medium-low pressures and during short periods of approximately 15 minutes. This session is complemented with the application of Mode 3 at medium pressures for 10 or 15 minutes more. Mode 4 or Sequential A sequential and unsustained compression is carried out. As the proximal segment is compressed, compression ceases in the immediately distal segment. A softer and superficial draining effect is achieved, which is similar to a massage, used at low pressures on slight edemas when venous alterations are present. Mode 5 or lymphatic. Compression of the different segments follows the rules of manual lymphatic drainage. It begins at the proximal part of the extremity to give way to the liquid that is being propelled from the areas that are becoming distal. Also following the rules of manual lymphatic drainage, this method is employed with low pressures. The larger the lymphatic edema component in the area, the lower they are. Combined treatment. 